Today we have an Octavo food chopper processor blender thing. So let's uh, take a quick look at this. Let's see here, we've got two liter capacity, 300 watts, and uh, all right, let's see what we have in here, huh? All right, and we have our operation manual. Looks like we have some sort of scraper or cleaner. Here's the business end. Nice covering, protective covers on those. And I have two. Looks like, I'm guessing these are stacking together. Probably should read instructions, but yeah, that's, that looks about right. That's snapped nicely. And let's get this open. Here we have the, I'm going to guess the main power, the business end of it. And and the power plug is not removable, but it looks like the actual mortar part of it removes from the bowl. So, six one half does the other, I guess. If I ever get this open, there I go. And supposed to be a decent link of a cord. And right off the top, I see three buttons here. I'm gonna guess those are speed setting. And that's that's a glass bowl. That's I was expecting a plastic, but no, that's that's pretty heavy. All right, so we got a gasket here to make sure things don't go flying everywhere and all right oh what's this got a I'm gonna guess that goes down here it's my guess doesn't stay very well all right now thankfully I have a dinner that might do well with being chopped up. So I'm going to get this a quick rinse off and then I'm going to come back and we're going to try to plug it in. All right, so I got this all rinsed off and I probably should read the instructions before I start using a power tool, but whatever. This snaps together as you saw earlier. It looks like it snap sits on right here, the spin. Take our lid, put that on top, and then the main power business is going to go here. But I guess I have to have something to chop first. So, got some bell pepper, which is going to go well with dinner. And probably don't want to eat the sticker, so let's take the sticker off. All right. There we go. Lid. And looks like these set in here, so it doesn't really matter what direction you put it on. And get that centered. Turn this it's plugged in. I don't see an option to turn it on. Well, I guess it goes back to I should read the instructions before I try to put things together. All right, so I did it right, just had to turn the blade just a little bit. So this is going to be our low, medium, high. So let's do a quick low pull. And she said she wanted them fine, so let's take a look to see what that looks like. So, spatula, get stuff off the edges, get this big piece out there. All right, give that a few more seconds. And we should have our finely diced bell pepper for dinner. And there we go. Not too shabby.